ABC. Biggest stars are ready to play the game's biggest week this day. And it's Joel Embiid, who is the MVP. He's never won a game seven. He's never been to a conference final. He can change all that today against the young superstar, Jason Tatum, just 25 years old, but already his sixth game seven. It's the Celtics and the Sixers for all the marbles next on ABC. Game for us. Who doesn't love game seven? It's got to be a dog fight. It's going to be a war. I'm ready for war. Just like they've won here. MC, make another hit. It's a three. You gotta be ready to scrap. You gotta be ready to be able to bleed to do whatever it takes to win. Wow, this will set up a dramatic game seven here in Boston. If you're there, you're in your home, down the street at a friend's house, I don't care. I need you to come with the energy. No excuses. We need everybody. Welcome to NBA Countdown, presented by Chai. Good afternoon and welcome to the NBA on ABC. You cannot ask for more than we have for you today with the Celtics and the Sixers playing a game seven. And we will spend the overwhelming majority of the next hour counting it down to that the game. game seven when they've gone against LeBron James. I don't see LeBron James on the Sixers. And I don't uh, see them losing, losing three games during a series. That's what we think. Mike Breen, it's your home. turn in Boston. Take it away. All right, Mike, thank you so much, and welcome everyone to Boston, Massachusetts on a beautiful Mother's Day. Of course, it's in May, so, of course, another special playoff game on Causeway Street. Another Game 7 to add to the Celtics' rich history of Game 7s. And this one against an old rival with a berth in the Eastern Conference Finals on the line in hopes of an NBA title still alive. The playoff bracket, Miami Heat awaiting the winner of today. The Eastern Conference Final will start on Wednesday. Nuggets and Lakers begin Tuesday night in Denver in the West. Here inside the TD Garden, Joel Embiid, the league MVP, his finest season. Can he lead his team on the road, finally out of the second round? For the Celtics, Jason Tatum, he saved their season with a four-minute stretch in game six. Now they're back home to try and advance once again to the conference final. And good afternoon, everyone. Along with Mark Jackson, Mike Green, on hand, Lisa Saltos with us as well. What a perfect way to end the second round. The eighth game seven between the Celtics and the Sixers. Mark, let's start with Philadelphia. They lost a golden opportunity at home on Thursday night, but that's out of the way. They've got another chance. What do they need to do to get over this second round home? These are the moments where you need your best players to perform. That points the finger directly to Joel Embiid. His impact on both ends of the floor is undeniable. Energy, effort, and enthusiasm. Turn over here. He's got to put extra effort. Look at the chase now. Making the extra hustle play with the block. And then offensively, if you get a single matchup, dominate. If they put two guys on you, trust the players around you. Get rid of the basketball and know that you're going to get it back. Be ready to lock and load and make plays. He's got to be absolute dominant, Mike, and is not asking much for the regular season MVP. Look at his numbers in the regular season. He's got to get back to that guy. He lives his life and the possibility of an Eastern Conference trip. Meanwhile, for the Boston Celtics, their season, their dreams of a championship came also close to ending on Thursday night. But they had the heroic from Tatum, Tatum in the fourth quarter. What's to keep them in now to advance? Again, the best player, that's Jason Tatum. He's been inconsistent at times throughout the course of this series. But when it matters most, they put the ball in his hands, and he not only showed up, but he showed out time and time again down the stretch of game six. He made big-time plays, individually dominating his matchup, stretching to the three-point line, unselfishly making plays, and timely hoops. He's got to get back to the consistent, dominant Jason Tatum that we've come to trust and love, Mike. And Tatum's numbers from the series, it's been up and down. Now a chance here in game seven. 
the NBA's history of Game 7. So many memorable moments. And the Celtics and Sixers, with some of the greatest players to ever play the game, have been a part of that history. Who will be the latest to deliver an unforgettable performance as this presentation of the NBA playoffs continues after this message and a word from our ABC station. The Google Pixel NBA Conference Semifinals on ABC are delivered by Chipotle. Real ingredients, real flavor. Chipotle, for real. And Google Pixel Fold, the only foldable engineered by Google. The number seven, when it stands alone, is just a number. But when you put the word game in front of seven, it becomes epic. It becomes historic. Here's Tatum, fires over and beat, got it! In this place, the power is the belief. We're confident. We've been confident. The power is the trust. Nothing will determine. The only way I get respect is if I win the championship. I had to level up, I was too big. Back to the hood, we going back to the base. That's where they had you with smiling your face. Side step, three points. Now we all, there we going crazy. This is our journey. This could be our last opportunity. It's got to be a dog fight. This is our glory. It's one game. I'm ready to get it on. Who doesn't love game sevens? with the Philadelphia 76ers and the Boston Celtics. The NBA playoffs are presented by Google Pixel. And here in Boston, the conference semifinals delivered by Chipotle. What a gorgeous day. Happy Mother's Day to all the wonderful mothers out. And here for the basketball fans, a game seven to end this second round of what has been a wild playoff stretch. So many unpredictable games, so many unpredictable outcomes. As we look at the starting lineups, and the same starting five for Doc Rivers with Harden, Maxey, Harris, Tucker, and the MVP, Joel Embiid. Meanwhile, for the Boston Celtics, for the second straight game, Robert Williams will start. And Derek White will come off the bench, the remaining four remain the same for the Boston Celtics and their head coach, Joe Mazzulla. Mark, who would have thought coming into this series, the road team will have won four of the first six games. Hard to imagine. It is, but that's what happens when you have legit superstars on your team. They have the ability to go into somebody else's house and win a 